Roxanne, you're my best friend, partner, and the love of my life. We connected so deeply early on, and I knew that I wanted to spend my life with you. We've already done so much over the years together, from traveling the world and visiting new places, buying a home together, and now getting married. I feel so safe when I'm with you, and it's clear that's where I'm supposed to be. In August of 2013, Roxanne packed up and we drove her to Edmonton to start a new chapter in her life. She was going to U of A. She was excited and ready to take on new adventures. I still remember texting Roxanne from the trailer, worried that she would be lonely and waiting for her response. Turns out she didn't answer my text because she was busy meeting people, having so much fun and doing just fine. Before we left her, I remember saying, now don't you fall in love with an Alberta boy. <laughs> as difficult as it was to send her to Alberta, her journey led her to meeting Kelton, which we are so grateful for. In October of 2015, Roxanne was FaceTiming with myself and my mom, Irene, her Maymay. Maymay always asked Roxanne, are there any cute boys in Alberta? She would answer yes. And then Maymay asked, do you have a boyfriend? Her and Kelton had just gone on a few dates, and it wasn't quite official yet. So she replied, ask me in a few weeks, with the biggest smile on her face. Kelton, I remember when you first came into my life eight years ago and how excited I was to tell my friends and family about you. I first imagined being your wife the first summer we were together. We were sitting on the beach looking at the ocean and talking endlessly for hours when I could picture so clearly spending my life with you. Your kind nature, calm demeanor, how you spoke so highly about your family and the way you put others ahead of yourself has always stood out to me. Roxanne, you're such a beautiful person inside and out. And there are so many things that I love about you. I love your heart and how genuinely kind you are. You're always the person that brings up the good attributes about anyone. I've been so fortunate to see you grow into the amazing person that you are today. And I'm so proud of you for all of your accomplishments. You've always prioritized our relationship and I feel your love in the way you show care, understanding and empathy. You took an airplane every other weekend for a year when we lived in different provinces. You moved across the country for me without any hesitation and you supported me in a career change. You've always been by my side in moments of success and vulnerability and have believed in me in times when I didn't believe in myself. <laughs> what do you think? Hmm. Oh, beautiful. what I thought, but it's, it's, it's amazing. It's so great. Oh. Well, not much longer. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Look at us now. These experiences allowed us to grow together and form a deep connection. Our love is so rare, and I don't think everyone finds this kind of love. We always talked about what we wanted our future to look like, and here we are standing in front of each other at the altar getting married. I can't wait to travel the world together, fill our home with children and dogs, and grow old with you as we experience life together and achieve our dreams. I can't wait to continue to explore and just enjoy our lives together. There are so many more milestones that I can't wait to reach together. I'm so proud to be your husband. I love that I can say that now. It's so comforting to know that we get to spend our lives together. You add so much to my life and I love you more than I could ever put into words. I love you so much.